so I am going to discuss with you uh, segment engagement report, list engagement, and list growth reports in Calabria. Okay. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Ali Reza and welcome to my YouTube channel Marketing Chamber. So here I upload the tutorials regarding Clavio and email marketing, especially uh, from basic to advanced. So let me uh, just clear, uh, like mostly ask me like, uh, does I have uh, tutorials in Urdu only or uh, either they are available in English. So let me just clear you. So then we will uh, like jump back in the video. So here you can see the uh, thumbnails, uh, like green circle behind my head. So just these tutorials are in Urdu, except all these tutorials, every tutorial is in English language. Okay. So just these are in Urdu and all other tutorials are in English language. Okay. So that's great. So let's just now start it. Uh, so where you can find the segment engagement report, list engagement report and list growth report. So first, let me tell you uh, about segment engagement report. So for that, you have to go to any segment. So let's suppose like I, I go to this uh, segment. Okay. So, and I will show you uh, how like you can understand the engagement report of any specific segment you want. So here you will go reports and engagement. Okay. So then I will show you, I will uh, tell you everything uh, you need to know. So uh, it's taking time. So here you can see a new dashboard. Okay. So here, like you can domain, you can see the domains. Uh, if you want to filter, if you want to analyze the stats engagement, uh, like based on any domain, so you can specify from here. Uh, otherwise, you can select all. From here, you can update if uh, if you are seeing like uh, this engagement was uh, uh, updated in the previous any day, in the past days. Okay, so you can just click here and you can update it. So next, here you can see operate is seventy three point twenty one percent in the past thirty days based on the emails they received and the click rate was 1.12 percent past 30 days and average order value uh, is uh, like 52.22 dollar past 30 days so these uh, are the stats based on past 30 days number of emails they received so the member engagement engagement over the last 30 days as i mentioned earlier so this is like very engaged profiles and that is 37.5% uh, and that is all about 3,976. And next is not engaged and this is 45.7% and here you can see the uh, yellow color, it is somewhat engaged, like little bit. And barely engaged and then is uh, received no emails and that is 1.5%. So it can be uh, due to like they are now suppressed they like uh, unsubscribe from your list or any other reason i do have uh, like mark them unengaged and you are not sending emails and they are also uh, not qualifying for your club uh, flow emails okay so there can be many other uh, reasons uh, they're not receiving email from your site okay so now let's jump to the next section and that is engagement distribution over time okay so engage profiles open greater than 20 percent of messages they receive so if anyone show 20 greater than 20 percent open rate based on the email they receive so they are marked as engaged profiles okay and before understanding this graph here you can see age of profiles so you know what you need to understand what is the age of profile okay but before that let me tell you this graph is based on one year only like here you can see 52 weeks and we know one year includes contains 52 weeks okay so just suppose that this graph starting from uh by 2022 to my 2023 now let's suppose 
if any profile subscribe to your brand one week before the may 2022 so the first week of may will be second week of that profile obviously and if any profile subscribe to a brand in the first week of may 2022 so that will be the first week of that profile okay so from here you can see the one week two week three week and if any profile is existing in Clavio from past 15 weeks so you can find that profile under this category under this age of profile okay so i hope ki, uh, you understand what is the true meaning of age of profile so now let's understand this graph now so first week in the first week the profiles uh, you can see 52 are engaged 54 are unengaged and five never received emails so that can be uh, due to many reasons like unengaged suppressed unsubscribe whatever and similarly you can see uh, like uh, based on like a group of people whose age is uh, eight feet so 60 are in, engaged and 40 are unengaged and there's no one who never received email never received any email okay so this is the main part this is very important thing to understand that i hope okay, i could deliver, deliver to you okay so and based on that you can understand like how which type of behavior you are getting from your subscribers like either they are engaged from they join us to the last or the engagement is going down or the engagement is going up or the engagement is going fluctuations so based on that you can understand what you are doing what you have to strategize to optimize your process okay so if the engagement is going down so you have to find out where is the loophole i hope you understand so from here operate by age of profiles like right? how you can understand the operate based on the age of profiles that i have discussed with you like what is the meaning of age of profile and if you feel any issue in understanding this so please mention in the comment section and i will come to you because i love to help my peeps so here you can see the first week like profiles whose age is equal one week they are showing 63 operate similarly the maximum operate we are getting for those profiles uh with age of with 16 weeks age okay so similarly you can understand from this how they are engaging with you from start to the last okay but remember these are the graph just showing you uh within the range of one year only okay and say the number of engaged profiles by age of profile so from here you can also check out how they are engaged unengaged and how many they are so this was the engagement of any segment you want to check so now let's discuss further the list engagement and list growth okay so uh, just click on list and segment okay so then uh, i will go to any list like you can do uh, the same you want to analyze any specific list in your scenario so let's uh, let me discuss with you newsletter list that will be uh, easy for us uh, to understand because you can see the growth rate the engagement very easily i hope so so from here same you can see uh, click on report and first i will uh, discuss with you the list growth how you can understand what information you can get from this section from this dashboard okay so first of all this is the option like date range like in which date range you want to check out your list growth okay so you can specify from here so and next view by you can uh, filter out you if you want to uh, like analyze the stairs analyze the growth rate by week or by uh, monthly 
Okay, so it's up to you. And you can export to CSV also to analyze further in Google Sheet in any other tool you want. So first, list size and growth. So in that list, there are 3,174 members. And from here you can see, okay? So the total members. So from here you can see uh, in December, there were total numbers 1,434. In January, it was 1,741. But in the May, this is 3,174. It means the numbers are growing time to time, monthly. Okay? So that's good to analyze. And new membership chain, like how many numbers, how is the difference, how much is the difference between two months? You can check from here. Like if I want to check uh, the chain between December and January, so this was like 330 members we gained and we lost 23 members. From here, you can see this red section showing how many members you lost and the green section is showing you how many members you gained. 330 okay so from here you can see uh, in the February uh, like we have 1988 members and in January <coughs> sorry so in January uh, there were only 1741 so that is about I think uh, the difference is 330 okay so same you can see the difference uh, like you can see the difference from other, for other uh, like months like if you want to uh, like figure out how much is the difference between February to March so you can see from here okay so from here subscriber sources like from which resources you are gaining you are capturing the leads okay so from here multi-step email SMS like December 91 and no like other uh, lead we get from other uh, resources okay so in January 330 I know other leads we get from other uh, any other resource and but let me first uh, let me explain to you May 23 so we got we capture 240 new leads from this sign up form and 166 we got from Shopify because we are synchronizing them in Calabria, so that's right. And 11 we got from like this sign up form, and 3 we got uh, from subscribe page, so that is good. So, in that way, you can analyze from like which resources, which sources are like giving you the leads okay so based on that you can optimize your processes so next is unsubscribe method so here you can see why you are losing the numbers okay so as i can see uh, in january we lost 23 members okay so january like so uh, the one profile was having invalid email okay we lost it Three we lost due to hard bones. Eight we lost due to spam complaint. Eleven due to unsubscribe. So they unsubscribe from unsubscribe page. So the total numbers, if we calculate, one, three, eight, eleven. So that is about twenty-three. And you can see from here twenty-three. So from that you can understand where they are leaving us. Okay, and you can like if the, the number is uh, high. So. In order, like if you optimize the process so that you can retain, you can engage, you can make a strong bond with your leads, okay? So you can convert lead into the customer. You can ask their preferences, why they are unsubscribing, why they are leaving us. So you can strategize for other customers, for other prospects. So that could be a, like a helping hand, that could be like I'll show you magnificent results for you okay so now let's uh, discuss about uh, list engagement so the options are almost same as we have discussed for the segment okay so options we have discussed in uh, for segment so you can see here also like open rate 69.77 percent 
uh, 2.42%, so that is good. And 54.21 average offer rate, uh, average order value. Okay, so from here open, uh, like member engagement, you can see uh, member distribution over time, age of profile, and again, as we discussed for segment engagement uh, section, uh, here you can also see the upper rate. Uh, we have a maximum upper rate uh, from those profiles with 24 weeks age. Okay, so you can like analyze this board also. And from here, you can uh, find out the number, how many numbers are engaged, how many numbers are unengaged. Like in nine weeks, uh, we have 59 engaged profiles and 53 unengaged profiles. Okay, so this was our today's tutorial, segment engagement, list engagement, and list growth report in Calabria. So I hope you like this tutorial, you learned something new, and if you do so, please subscribe my channel and stay tuned, stay happy. Thank you.